Hi guys, I'm Holly from Vitmill and we've got Kev, you know Kev. Hi. Uh, today we're doing a flavour review on the Dober. Dober. We've got five of them and we've got three Lick remixed in them horrible snap sample things, easy snaps. So, probably start with the Dober first because they're going to make less of a mess. I'm in Fuse Clapton's at 0.26. And Kev's it in flat Clapton's uh, 0.1 in his brand new Elverb. This one is apple. That's an appleberry. Appleberry pie. It smells quite nice. Very prominent. Mm. That tastes like smells and I can't think of what. I don't dislike it. It's quite prominent. There's mm. a, a flavour, it's a prominent flavour. Yeah. It's not something I buy, but... It's appleberry pie. Strawberry tail. To point out, it's not strawberry, it's strawberry. Spelled B E A R Y. I'm not usually keen on strawberry flavors, it's too sweet for my liking usually. I don't mind strawberry. I don't think that's very prominent. I think it's quite weak. It's not got much flavour at all. It tastes like... It tastes a little bit like you've had a strawberry flavour, emptied it and put some VG in it. <laughs> That's what it tastes like. Next up we've got... Angel Cupcake. Not Cup... Cub. Angel Cupcake. Go out of like vanilla. No, but angel cake, won't it? I don't think I've ever had angel cake, I'm not sure. Mm. That tastes like last one. It's got a slight hint of vanilla. If you give me a sample of both of them, I won't be able to tell <coughs> No. It's also worth pointing out, guys, this is, as usual, unedited. Obviously, I'll put my uh, watermark on it and blah, blah, blah. But I'm not going to do any editing, not cutting any out. Unless one walks in, obviously, then I'll pause it and then resume. Uh, next one is raspberry ice cream. Oh, oh no, raspberry ice cream. That's there's no pun, but there is. I've got a feeling this is going to taste like restaurant. Not similar taste. That's got more of a hint of raspberry in it. It's not the most prominent flavour still, but. None of them seem to be good in flavour. Next one is Lemon Grizzle. Lemon Grizzle. And it's also worth pointing out guys that these weren't sent for reviewing, they were sent to the shop. So there's no sponsorship here, it's just me trying stuff that I've got. No, it actually tastes like lemon. <clears throat> it's not very prominent still. Lost in lady, £15. I'd, pr I'd probably buy a lot of that for nine, <coughs> nine, ten quid. 
I won't, no. spend, I won't spend any more than a ten on it though. No. It's best flavour out of them all. So they were door berries. If you, if you, like I said before, I don't really do this for you to take my word for it because everyone's got a different flavour. But if you're going to choose any out of the door berries, I'd choose the lemon grizzle. Mm. Or the, the apple berry. Because they're the most prominent out of the lot. But each to their own, guys. I won't judge you. My mud is very hot. Yeah. I've just put batteries back in my camera. And my camera battery chargers have got a fan on. And uh, still, they were boiling up because it's quite hot weather here. Um, so now we're moving on to the Lick Remixed. I like it. This one is the Dib Dab, which I quite like Dib Dab flavours. Although I don't like these packaging. Guys, if you ever get one of these, because last year we had them at the, well, this year we had them at the Expos and stuff, you literally just snap it in the middle and then it creates a packet. It is really unideal packaging. I don't know why people are starting to use it. But then you just squeeze as you drip on. I like it. I like it a lot. Yet again, it's not the most prominent flavour, is it? It's. It's got good flavour. It's not weak flavour. It? It's, it's, it's not a. It's not one of the most prominent flavours, but it is a decent flavour as well. It's got better flavour than them ones. Yeah, out of that one, that is better than all the door bears. Raspberry Dripple by Licked Remix. Or Lick Remix, sorry. Take two off. Yeah, if you can get back on. <laughs> yeah. There we go. That's quite a smooth, sweet flavour. I think I like that. You like hugs your mouth. Mm. Yeah. Well, they are messy, aren't they? I do think, guys, I do think that the lick range, don't quote me on this, but I think my rep said that they go for about between 10 and 12 pound RRP. If that's the case, they are really good. And if you say any, I would recommend getting some. Or at least trying some. Sorry, I forgot to tell you, this one is the Jelly Berry. Jolly Bear, not Jolly Bear. It tastes, don't taste like a Jolly Bear, but it just tastes like jelly. It's not got as much flavour as the other two. No, that's what I mean, it tastes like jelly, because jelly's quite warm, mm. really. It's so not so much Jolly Bear, but more jelly. Thanks for watching, guys. Short, straight to the point. Uh, we do these more for fun than we do for anything else. Uh, it's just trying to in private, may as well try them on camera. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell. I enjoyed this far more than I enjoyed the cheese ones. Um, <laughs> yeah. If you haven't seen the cheese ones, scroll through the videos. We're on the all the playlists on the playlist. We're on the flavor reviews, or flavor testing, whatever I call the playlist. Thanks for watching, guys. Subscribe, ring the bell, thumbs up. Uh, don't forget to follow us on Snapchat. Facebook and Instagram. Thanks guys, stay cloudy.